poison control. Is this Kirk going to help you? Yes, yeah, so my, my two-year-old daughter just drank some mineral spirit. This is literally 20 or 30 seconds. Ayla, you okay? Ayla. Ayla, you okay? A little tiny cap full of mineral spirits. Ayla went on top of the counter and grabbed this cap. Can you look at me? Can you look at me? Are you okay? Yeah. I saw Ayla had the cap in her hand, but she had the mineral spirits in her mouth um, and had ingested it. Hey, you stay with us, okay? Hey, 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 you stay with us, okay? Worst day of my life. I got a call sometime in the afternoon uh, from a gentleman stating that they thought that their child had ingested some mineral spirits. Uh, as a dad, a, a scared parent, I was, you know, not in the right mind to think. I can hear kind of coughing there. Is she able to breathe though properly? Aspiration of hydrocarbons is the leading liquid poisoning killer of children. When you're holding your, your child in your arms and, you know, their eyes roll in the back of their head and they're gagging and gasping and turning blue, you know, you, uh, I can still picture it today. We'll just try and keep her as calm as possible. Okay. And then offer yeah. her something to drink. As a parent, uh, as an EMS person, and as a certified specialist of poison information, I was extremely concerned and I and it really just tugged at the heartstrings. But, you know, maintain there, I realized that I was basically his rock for him at this point in time. I'll stay in the line until they get there. Okay. There's about 20 minute wait for the ambulance to get to us. You, do, you are thinking it's a very, very long period of time. Please come, where are the paramedics? Well, that's what happens when you live in. in Small town Minnesota in, in rural Minnesota. Inflammation, coughing, pulmonary edema, and even respiratory failure. So treatment's pretty much supportive. There was multiple other phone calls going on simultaneously to the ER doc, to the ambulance. Please help me. I, I'll do anything you tell me to do. I know you guys are the experts. And in this case, that's how that clinician was at that at initial hospital. You need resources like the Poison Center. They're a phone call away. They're seven hours away drive, but they're a phone call away. Poison control, this is Kirk, can I help you? Minnesotans call about 48,000 times each year. All 87 counties utilize the Poison Center. Instead of being an allergic reaction or a chemical sensitivity, it might be a direct effect to the chemicals. 91% of the time, patients that start in the home, we can keep at home. And we do that by providing medical assessment, treatment, and then follow-up calls to make sure the patient does well. In these situations, you can't think straight. You, you can't think of what's the best thing to do. You need someone else to guide you and direct you. It's not a service that you can um, just type in um, a question and get an answer back, say, on the Internet. For every dollar spent on poison control services, there's over $13 saved of unnecessary health care costs and lost productivity. Hey, Kurt. Welcome. Kurt. Good to meet Very you. Very nice to meet you. Yeah. Appreciate it. Oh, absolutely. I've never met such a caring staff before. They're just awesome. You know, I was just doing my job, but that personal connection that really uh, brings it home is very, very satisfying. Um, a little tearful. <laughs> and uh, just, just to see her running around happy. And Yeah, uh, do you remember when you drank that yucky stuff? Yeah. Yeah, do you remember that? Yeah. Yeah. Kirk, Kirk helped us when, when you drank that yucky stuff. This all worked out well. The system worked. Everything worked. Everybody's happy. And I got to meet her a year later, and it was and the family, just an awesome family. Every day they're just doing amazing work for the, every community in the state. Our family speaks for every family that's had to call the Poison Center. Every family is so thankful that we have this resource and these people in a phone call away.